by Burger Crawl 2017 in search of the best fast food cheeseburger. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another video. This is where I try something or three and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. So today, something different. I'm actually calling it the 2017 Cheeseburger Crawl, Burger Crawl. Trying to figure out what is the best cheeseburger, the basic cheeseburger from the top three of the burger places out there, McDonald's, Burger King, and Wendy's. So without further ado, let's check out the first stop on Burger Crawl, Cheeseburger Crawl. I don't know. We're not crawling either. I'm driving there, but here we go. So yes, McDonald's, that is the first stop. I got a basic cheeseburger right here. So we're gonna open this bad boy up. This was $1.49. You're probably all familiar with the cheeseburger. There you go. Kind of looks like the uh, head of the old school Hamburglar. Remember that guy? But yeah, there you go. So we're gonna pop the top, kind of remind you of what goes on a burger here over at McDonald's. So you got the uh, ketchup and the mustard pickles, some of the chopped onions, toasted bun, no sesame seeds. So wish me luck. Here's the first stop on the tour. We're going with the McDonald's cheeseburger, $1.49. The clown. Here we go. Okay. Now you know what you're getting here because this is a very iconic burger. I love how the onions mix in with the ketchup and the mustard on this. Now what really sets off the McDonald's cheeseburger for me ever since I was a kid to now an adult acting like a kid sometimes, but uh, the pickle really adds that kind of snap and acidity to me. So this is only gonna be one bite. I'm taking one bite of these things, a pretty decent sized bite right there. So now let's move on to the next stop. Who could it be? All right, second stop. We're back at Wendy's. Burger Crawl 2017 in search of the best cheeseburger. All right, stop number two, Wendy's. We just finished Wendy's week and I'm returning. That does not mean that the endorsement Wendy's wedding is back on. That just means uh, I got a burger from there. So we're gonna open this up, check out this burger. Now the looks of this, it looks a little bit smaller and this was actually $2.09. So there is the basic cheeseburger from the folks over at Wendy's. See what we got there definitely smaller than what we were looking at for the $1.49 burger from McDonald's. So we're going to open this up. We're going to see that there's ketchup. I believe that is mustard. No, no mustard. Ketchup, pickles, and red onions on top of that burger. So wish me luck. Here we go. This is almost slider-like for $2.09. <sighs> Here we go. Wish me luck. Endorsement style. Yeah, so I know it's not the uh, quarter pound patty or the single patty. This is their, you know, value menu burger, but this is a small burger. This is like a three or four biter. It basically is very similar to that of a slider. I've not had a basic burger from Wendy's in a while. Again, that pickle snap for me, I love pickles. I love the way it just adds to it. There's something about this though that is missing the mark a little bit. No spoilers. So let's move on to the third and final stop. You know where we're going. Here we go. All right, so we are over here at the King. Now this thing was one dollar. That is correct. One dollar for their basic burger. You do have the sesame seed bun. There is the cheese right there. Looking very good, I might say. Smelling up the car with some burger goodness. So now we open this up. And very similar, you see the uh, pickles, the ketchup, and the mustard. No onions on this, the major difference from the other two. So now wish me luck, we're going into the third and final one here on the Cheeseburger Crawl 2017. Wish me luck. Cheese is melted nicely. 
at the mustard right there. I'm trying to escape Shawshank. Andy Dufresne. Yeah. Again, I love the pickle. I just love the pickle. I love the snap that goes on in there. Take a look. Upside down action. Upside down. Hmm. The more you turn me inside out. And all right. So I don't know. This one had a little too much mustard for me. But again, every visit's going to be different. Unless I'm in the mood to order it special, I order without the mustard and I know it's going to come out fresh. But this one is fresh. It is hot. Does have a nice taste to it. I don't know. This is going to be a tough, tough decision. I already went into this thing. I already know what I like the best, but I've never eaten them in succession. One, two, three. Here we go. All right. So I'll just say that I got the McDonald's large because they're doing the special $1 for any large drink uh, during the summer. But check this out. The straw. Yeah. Look at that. Comes up to a little nub. So interesting story, I went to Wendy's and as he was giving me my burger, I said, check out McDonald's, check what they're doing. They're giving me like a little nipple. So you know what we're doing? Wendy's hooked me up with a straw. He's like, you gotta have a straw that goes all the way to the bottom of your cup, homie. I'm like, thank you, sir. We're gonna rock it out. Let's see how this looks. Look at that. Wendy's coming correct inside of McDonald's cup. Now I'm telling you, Wendy, if you rocked $1 for your large, I'd be all over it. Not so sure though. McDonald's has some really good Coke. Soda. All right, so final breakdown on this and crowning a winner. For price, definitely Burger King. I mean, it's a dollar and it is a really good sized burger. For taste, I'm actually leaning to McDonald's, believe it or not. I don't know if that's just the nostalgia going on in my head, retro action, but uh, somehow that uh, Wendy's burger, I like the taste of the Wendy's beef, but I don't know, again, if that small size, like the slider size, was messing with me, but it was kind of missing something. So here we go. Drum roll, please. If I had to put these in order of what I received today, what I tried today, my one bite shark week attempt, I'm going to say... Coming in number three is going to be Wendy's. And I went into this thinking Wendy's was going to be number one. But it was the most expensive, it was the smallest, and it did not come correct with the flavor. The number two, I'm actually going to go with... Burger King. I'm going to put Burger King number two. I bet if they didn't have a heavy hand on that mustard, it might have hit the number one mark again today. But number one today in the 2017 endorsement cheeseburger crawl, I'm going to give it to the McDonald's cheeseburger. There you go. $1.49, decent size, great nostalgic taste, and something about the way everything works on a McDonald's cheeseburger is what put it over the top. So there you go. Another video in the books. Don't forget to please like, comment, and subscribe. I would definitely appreciate that. I also do social media, Instagram and Twitter. No MySpace. All right, bonus footage. If you want to see all three of those burgers on top of each other under one bun, a while ago, I actually did that. I did the, I believe I called it the ultimate fast food cheeseburger, and I actually put each one on top of each other and uh, kind of condensed them and kind of did a review on that. So I'll probably find that video, put the link below. But thank you for joining me on this little uh, cheeseburger crawl. I hope you enjoyed it. Something a little different, something a little fresh. I don't know.